Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we're talking about Facebook Messenger and more specifically, I'm going to show you how to turn off the active now status for your Facebook Messenger on iPhone or the app, Facebook Messenger app. So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off, why would you want to turn off your active now status? Well, that's pretty easy. If you happen to be messaging with somebody on Facebook Messenger, but you don't want all of your contacts to see that you're online, maybe you told them you're out of town, maybe you told them you're at work, whatever the case is, this is an easy way to kind of protect that privacy of yours. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, guys. This is going to be a really quick one. Not a lot of steps involved, but I'm going to show you a couple of different workarounds. First off, you want to go ahead and open up your Facebook Messenger. It's this blue and white one with a little lightning strike on it. I'm going to go ahead and open mine now. Okay, guys, I went ahead and opened up my Facebook Messenger. Sorry about this little paper thing. Obviously, if you are looking to turn off your active now status on Facebook Messenger, you can appreciate someone's privacy. So here on the home screen of the Facebook Messenger, it's kind of interesting because if you have your active now status, you can see when other people are active. So for example, these recent stories up here on the top, these little green dots indicate that this person is either active or have been active recently on Facebook Messenger. So if I want to go ahead and message them, they can't say, oh, I wouldn't, wasn't near my phone or something like that. Also here on this section down here, for example, this person, let me see if I can call, zoom in on the color, but basically it lets me know that this person was active eight minutes ago. So if this person happened to tell me, well, I don't have my phone for the past hour, then I know that they're lying. So if you can see this about them, they can see that about you. So how do you turn that off? Pretty easy. All you want to do is click on your profile picture up here on the top left. I'm going to click there now. All right, once you get here, then you're going to see this screen with a lot of different options that you can change on your Facebook Messenger app. But you want to look for this button right here, this green and white one called Active Status. You can see mine is on right here. Let me click on that line now. Okay, so once you're here, here's where you can go ahead and turn off your Active Now status for your Facebook Messenger. And it's pretty easy. Just toggle this right here. I'm going to toggle mine now. All right, next this pop-up happens and lets you know that if you turn off your Active Status, my friends and contacts will not see when I'm active or recently active. But the thing is, you can't see when they were active either. So if you're okay with that, go ahead and click this red turn off button. I'm going to click there now. Okay, now my active now status is now turned off. Now let's go back to my contact list. Okay, so here I am back on my contact list. Apologize about all this stuff, but as you know, I like to private and that's probably why you're turning this off as well. But right here on this contact, there was a green dot that said eight minutes ago they were active. And as you can see, that green dot has now been removed. Also with these stories right here, there are no green dots to let me know who's been active recently and who has not been. So there you have it, guys. Guys, that is how you can turn off your active now status on your Facebook Messenger app. If you happen to know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below, let the rest know. One thing I do want to let you know is this turns off the active now for this particular device. You do need to change that for each device that you have open for your Facebook Messenger. It doesn't carry all the way throughout. That's just the way that Facebook works. It helps them gather more information on us. But hopefully you liked the video. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.